the unmanaged staff. We need some wine glasses. So you have them bring their own wine in here? Yes. What happened? You weren't able to get a beer wine license? Vodka is really tough. They're, they, they don't issue any liquor licenses. There's only 13 in the whole town. you got to purchase someone else's? Yeah. That is? yeah, and they sell for like a million dollars when they become available. Wow. So it's just not worth it. Is it all set? Yeah. yeah. Thank you. Have a good night, guys. Take care. We're all BYOP. Yeah. So nobody has an advantage. Okay, great. Do you wrap up the bottles for the customer to take home? If they ask for it, sure. Look at camera G. There she goes. She went right for the bottle. What is she doing? What is she doing with that bottle of wine? I mean, it's she set it up right behind the counter, yeah? Wow, look at this one. She's got a cup of ice. And she's pouring it on like moonshine. She's adding some seven up to it. She's keeping it behind the counter with the lid. Looks with like a straw. A soda. That's not good, Lily. Really. Now you see, look. So she's actually having a cocktail on the job. So even that you don't even have your own liquor license here, the customer left a half a bottle, and your staff is finding a way to make her own hooch and drink while working. Yeah, that's unacceptable. So what are your managers doing? 25, 65. Now how I think, I see this right away, and I have to say, okay, I need to make a procedure. What does that mean? Well, we need to make a rule with what happens if a customer leaves wine. It has to be handed to a manager, okay. to an authority figure automatically. Yeah. Is it good? It's really good. Issue number two. No protocols, no procedures, no rules and regulations. Tommy needs to put systems in place so everybody knows the do's and the don'ts of this business.